Well, I actually, I did have the opportunity to speak to Mr. Anderson on Thursday. Um, and so um, I think he was serious, but it's not a threat. Um, I think it's a kind of a, um, a, a process. So based on the accidents, um, that happened, and also um, a, a congressionally mandated um, rule that as of December 31st of this year, um, certain railroads need to have PTC compliance, which is a technology that's kind of like air traffic control for trains, um, that that needs to be in place. There have been many hearings and a lot of discussion about safety. So what Mr. Anderson um, so first of all, I think Amtrak is committed to abiding by the law and that those railroads that are required to install PTC, if they don't, then there will be no service on those lines after December 31st of this year. As it affects the Down Easter, it's only the MBTA portion that's required to have PTC installed because of the frequency of trains. MBTA is working on that and we expect that they're going to meet the deadline. Um, he did say that they that trains were not going to operate in dark territory, but I think that that but what he also further explained um, when he addressed a group of states the other day was that they were going to implement kind of a, a a safety review process, which is what we alluded to earlier, to take the portions of the railroad that didn't have that weren't required to have PTC and make sure that they there were other mitigations in place such as speed reductions. Um, to address any safety concerns that might exist. And this actually review and evaluation process is going to launch with an evaluation of the Rockland branch. It's going to be the first one that's going to be done. And then they're going to continue and probably review the rest of the Down Easter line as well. I think there is um, an interest. Mr. Anderson also spoke about, you know, even those uh, lines that aren't required to have positive train control, that perhaps Amtrak was perhaps interested in looking at other forms of technology that could serve as a redundancy um, to be able to enhance safety. But I don't think we're not anticipating that the Down Easter will be shut down as of December 31st. Um, and I think that Amtrak and Mr. Anderson and everybody there is very, very committed to making sure that the railroads are safe as can be.